I would say for the last four or five years, I've been getting like the worst allergies. Sneezing, a bit of tiredness, yeah. yeah. It can be hard to enjoy a beautiful Vancouver day if you're allergic to all of the cottonwood and pollen flying around. And family doctors in Metro Vancouver say seasonal allergies are just getting worse. As a family doctor, this is one of the, perhaps one of the worst allergy seasons I've seen. I've seen so many patients coming in with sneezing, itching, um, and an exacerbation of some of their usual asthma symptoms. First I lost my voice and now it's, I feel like he never come back. I didn't know if it was the, uh, the air quality, but I feel like I've been like hit by a bus. I went home, napped, had the best sleep at night. I'm just overly tired. An arborist says a variety of trees are responsible and they react to drastic temperature changes. And there's um, cottonwoods, Lombardi poplar, black cottonwoods, red alders, and and a host of other trees similar uh, to those uh, varieties, they produce pollen. So this rapid change of temperature the last one, two weeks we've had, they've suddenly overproduced this pollen. But it doesn't stop at pollen. Dr. Liang says more frequent wildfires and flooding due to climate change are also making his patients' problems worse. The wildfire smoke that we're seeing in Vancouver is exacerbating or making people's respiratory issues worse. Um, if you have flooding and you can have mold in your, in your home, in your basements, and that's an often a trigger for certain patients. For every trigger, many will reach across the counter for these. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, the, 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 non, the non drowsy stuff. Um, allergy pills? <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, you guys. I think we should just stop the climate change. We should work on that. Mm -hmm. I think that's a solution. In Vancouver, Kirjunos, City News.